How is up, y'all? Pop on Scrackin' SD, about to react to this video. This is craziest nature videos of the decade. Okay, where we're gonna see uh, what would they show in this vid. Will they show anything from this recent crazy situation in Florida? I'm not sure. Let's watch. These are the craziest nature videos from the past 10 years. I mean, not just in Florida, but y'all. to visit the glaciers in Iceland when a piece of the glacier actually broke off and fell into the water. Wow. 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 Get out of there. The wildest thing I've ever tried in my life. Back in 2017, Greenland was hit with a tsunami. Hey, uh, oh. Get out of here! Oh, you just there before? Back in 2020, this cruise ship was on its way to Ireland when it ran into some pretty heavy waves. Back in 2016, these people were hiking in Argentina when they realized that they were in a really bad spot. This scares me because I've been into like <laughs> more outdoorsy shit, especially when I travel. And um, I don't want to be caught up in no bullshit. This guy was loading up his car when he realized that he forgot his wallet. Wow. Back in 2018, this massive mudslide in Switzerland was called coming down a mountain. What month? Where is that This driver in China was almost hit by these falling rocks. Oh my god. I would have kept driving. In 2014, yeah. this volcano if he exploded. If he would have kept going, he would have like barely missed it, I feel like. But good thing he stopped. In Papua New Guinea, and it created a huge shockwave. Here we go. November 30th, 2018, a 7.0 earthquake hit Alaska. This volcano in Indonesia erupted and created some of the craziest volcano lightning you will ever see. Nebraska had some pretty crazy tornadoes earlier this year. Oh my god. Back in 2019, a super rare event happened that allowed parts of Southern California to receive snow. Also got to experience what snow and lightning is like. I got my umbrella, but I know I'm gonna get wet. I'm looking up, up like, in the mountains. Our street is starting to flood. <laughs> Imagine yeah. seeing this on your way to work. 
This is what the morning commute looked like for people driving into Los Angeles back in December 2017. From where? <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> this is what the morning commute looked like for people driving into Los Angeles back in December 2017. Into Los Angeles from where? Team. Oh, I never heard of this. Oh, was it? I remember there was some type of fires. Like, and it's so interesting. Like, I feel like when people see things like this and they hear things like this, especially about like wildfires and mudslides and shit, they don't realize like that'd be like way like up in in the mountains and shit and far out. Like, I don't ever see any wildfire. <laughs> I've never seen a wildfire in person. I've never encountered any of this at all. But I live in the city, so if you live in the city gonna have a very different experience but you know of course this is a thing but i've just never in all of my life that i've lived in california i've never seen one wildfire ever people think they're just so you know prominent they're everywhere <laughs> y'all got all those wildfires and muscles i ain't never seen no fucking mudslide in person in my life back in 2019 this giant landslide happened in china oh my god About 12 months ago, a super intense tornado went past this guy's house in Illinois. Sheesh. This hailstorm in Texas was so intense that the hail started coming inside the home. He left something outside in the rain oh. and had to go get it. <laughs> About seven months ago, these people in China were dealing with some pretty crazy wind. I need specific to the location, sir. Oh, oh, that was wild. Here's another rock slide video that happened in China in 2023. Back in 2015, Los Angeles had a very rare tornado event. Where? See, this is what I'm talking about. He's just giving the most vague, but I mean, this is probably all he knows, so I don't want to put blame on him. But it's like, bro, what? A tornado? No, I was here because I, I didn't I was in Texas from 2016 to 20 almost 2018. I'm pretty sure I left like 20 2017 towards the end of 2017. Yeah. Um I don't remember hearing about that at all. But again, it must be way, way, way. About six years ago, these people recorded their escape from a wildfire in California. crazy but also when you think of wildfires like obviously it has to be like in the cuts because it has to be hella trees and shit around and it's like when you live in the city this is not this reporter in france got a little too close to this wave girl get out of there back in 2018 in hawaii this car was parked in the worst spot possible In 2016, one of the biggest tornadoes in the history of Kansas was spotted. I know that icebergs are bigger underwater than above water, but this is kind of crazy. This is massive. Where is this? I need specific location. Because he naming places that I'm going next year. <laughs> so I'm like, um, sir, give me some... In Pakistan in 2018, these people got a little too close to this avalanche. <laughs> 
In 2020, this plane was struck by lightning when flying over Finland. This giant boulder came within inches of crushing this house. What planes are uh, Unfortunately, planes? two other boulders managed to break free and destroy the other side of the house. Hmm. In 2019, this cruise ship near Norway encountered some heavy seas. Okay, I know I'm not going to ever cruise ship. That far. I'm not that, I wouldn't want to anyway. I would take like three weeks to get there. <laughs> In 2021, so these people were rock climbing in Japan when an earthquake happened. <laughs> the snowboarder in Nevada accidentally triggered a giant avalanche. <gasps> This video from 2015 shows some sailors about to take on a giant wave. This is my perfect storm. Oh. <laughs> Y'all laughing? Let's go. In 2021, these firefighters were driving through some pretty crazy wildfires in California. I do actually remember uh it being on the news that there was like bad wildfires. A 6.7 magnitude earthquake interrupted this couple's wedding. That might be a song. <laughs> this dad tried to save his trampoline from being blown away in the wind. Trampoline? Hey, if you don't get there. your ass in the right, get in the house. Oh. Oh. Oh trampoline. <gasps> this video from Guatemala is probably the only video in the world like this. <laughs> this is called a cron flash and it was spotted in Florida back in 2020. I hope it's getting it out of the camera. I can't even see the screen. Holy Sometimes during a snowstorm, you can actually get lightning. Oh! In April 2022, this massive tornado hit Kansas. This is what it's like to get struck by lightning when you're in the cockpit of a plane. That's what I was saying in the previous clip. Um, the in 2018, one of the biggest tornadoes in the history of Wyoming was recorded. That's so cool. This looks like uh, that one movie. Mira, mira, no, el que viene de abajo. In 2018, four water spouts emerged on the coast of Thailand. I know Thailand when I see it. A sinkhole in Illinois randomly opened up earlier this year. I see where it's Oh no, that's not where I was looking. <laughs> I thought it was about to open right here. They were driving down a road in Sydney, Australia when this happened. Wow. Oh, oh my god. This guy was in a pool when an earthquake happened in Taiwan earlier this year. Oh yeah, I remember. I was in Singapore when this happened. This I house think. in Hawaii was developed like by a March. Mama back in 2018. It was March or April. Um, it was a big earthquake. And it was like real close to my homie going. He was there. These houses in Montana got buried under some tumbleweeds. Oh, shoot. That was so annoying. So clear. These scare me the most. I would say this is one of the scariest. 
multiple guys I heard him. Oh my god. Tsunami's too. It's a lot of them. Too. I don't really scary. Back in 2022, a huge meteor lit up the sky in Idaho. Oh. In 2020, a snowstorm in New York mixed with freezing rain, turning their homes into ice. Oh my god. This looks so scary. Are they trapped? In June 2020, a massive landslide took place in Norway and went into the sea. Where in Norway? I really want to go back to Norway. All the homes were empty, so luckily nobody was hurt. Yeah. Ooh, what you doing? Oh, man. You got, you got it. In 2022, Puerto Rico had flooding that was so severe that it destroyed this bridge. Glacier in Iceland fell into the water, creating a massive wave. Mm, what time of year? <laughs> but see, that's why I try to avoid places like this. These tourists on a cruise ship suddenly experience some extreme static electricity. This is actually a pretty scary warning sign as it means lightning could strike at any moment. Get inside! In 2019 in Amsterdam, this tornado was created within seconds. Wyoming had some pretty strong winds that happened earlier this year in April 2024. Oh my god. Oh no! No! This giant tornado was seen moving through Canada. That is the end of this video. This was uh, unsettling. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about these things and these places that he mentioned that um, I've already booked trips to go to. So I need specifics about where in these particular countries. But uh, specifically Northern um, Europe, I tried to definitely avoid going, you know, during their colder seasons because I feel like this is definitely when you're more likely to experience you know uh natural disasters like this but obviously it can occur any time of the year but yeah when it's cold and temperatures are really low that's when bad shit start happening <laughs> in a lot of these places but yeah i'm just like um where in <laughs> in these particular countries where but you know it is scary because living here in la like i'm not exposed to these really extreme natural disasters where i live specifically um because yeah we have earthquakes that happen but we get the babiest of baby earthquakes here in the city okay um we haven't had like a big earthquake in a long time i know people always say like, oh the big one is coming they've been saying that for about 30 years now <laughs> so um i'm sure it probably will come eventually yeah so we don't have a lot of experience with like crazy crazy natural disasters those of us who live in the city so things like this scare me and i'm just like oh shit i would never want to travel somewhere and something wild happens while i'm there you know like it's just kind of scary but um you know prayers for all these people he said nobody was hurt um in in these clips so um that's good at least y'all let me know what y'all think though let me know what other videos you've been watching i'll see y'all the next one bye